Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're playing Ember Ward. So yeah, this is just a demo, but um This is a very interesting game. You have like uh towers and it's it's very like Tetris themed, the way that the te uh, the pieces look. Um so yeah, so then you just choose different towers and we're gonna go through take a look at what we have. So we have a dice tower. So try your luck, the number you roll is the damage value of the tower. Ooh, that's cool. These flames, um, fire sharp icicles, the ta the lower an enemy's health, the more damage it inflicts up to three times. That's cool. I think I'm gonna go for this one because the dice tower seems pretty good. The cannon tower is cool. It's got like a, um, an area of effect. Frost Tower. Does this even freeze the surrounding monsters inflicting damage and slowing them? That's pretty cool. This has a lot of L. See, this is what I mean by the ed the Tetris aspect. It's got a lot of L pieces. So we're gonna go for this one mainly for the di uh, for the dice tower. Oh, okay. And there's relics as well. Okay. At the end of each wave, five of your towers will randomly transform into another tower of the same size. Oh, uh, I don't know. In each level, the first time your fire source takes damage, you freeze all enemies. There's even an additional 20 gold at the start of each level when you kill a monster affected by the chill effect. We don't really have anything like that. Upon completing a barracks challenge, you have an additional 50 ember stones. I don't know what ember stones are. Um, Chaos Transmuter just sounds like fun. So we're going to give that a try. Okay, let's take a look at like kind of where we want to go. I think um, I'm thinking. Okay, cr ba corrupted battle seems cool. We give that a try. I assume you probably get like a relic or something from that. So we could go here, then here, then here. Uh, but but it said something about barracks is having like a challenge thing. So actually, maybe I want to go this way. So go to this battle gun, go to the barracks, go to the battle, battle corrupted, go to the altar. I don't know what the altar does, but we'll find out, I guess. Go to a shop, and then go to a battle there. I mean, we could get a barracks anyways. But I think we probably wanted the barracks early on. Ooh, range boost tiles. Okay, tower placed above has its attack range boosted. Okay. Okay, so the enemies are both, or, okay, they're coming from this way. I see the different, the two different lines. So let's, can we, oh yeah, I guess we can. Okay, how do you rotate? Okay, you can rotate, okay. Let's do like that. And then we can have it go around that way. And then force them to go down this way. Okay. Um, I think this will be good with the, like, the area of effect stuff. And then, honestly, I think we'll kind of keep it like that for now. Have this guy kind of just roast them. Wow, he, oh, but he has a slow attack speed. Okay, I see, I see the problem. Okay, but we were fine. Oh, he was turned into a dice tower. Okay. So yeah, this chaos thing is gonna be very interesting. <laughs> Can I not? Okay, I can't put him there. What is, I, is there a way to rotate the map? No. Okay. Do 
be nice if I could rotate the map, though. Okay, well, um... There's gotta be, like, a better... Oh, yeah, I could put that like that. Okay, okay, we'll figure this out, we'll figure this out. Okay, um... Yeah, I think I like that one more. I think I like that position for it more. And then we could have it... Have that like that, go out like that. Okay, I think I, I, think I like that. I think that looks good. You know, honestly, I think we're going to do that. And then we could have it kind of go like straight that way. And we could put another dice tower there. Okay, so the damage is up to a three. Got a decent attack speed. I mean, it's 1.5 per second. I think this will be a good spot for him because it's like a straight on, like, shooting this way. Oh, okay, he's setting trees on fire. I did not realize that could happen. Well, we're literally lighting the forest on fire. Um, okay, now we got a cannon tower and this guy's out of three. Okay. Seems like the only number I can roll is a three. Great. Um... I guess we'll go like that, and then we can do that, and then that, and then... Maybe, I don't know. Because I want it to go around back this way. So... Maybe instead do something like this. That would be good, but I wanted to go back that way. Okay, I think that's a. I think that'll be good. I think that's good like that. Honestly, let's just build with like the cheap towers and see if we can get like more expensive towers to spawn in. That's actually not a bad idea. We have a bunch of like dice towers and uh, so then we, then we end up with a chance of, you know, a stronger tower spawning in by the end. FC, yeah, then they just get transmutated into more expensive towers. Okay, that's okay. Okay, let's. That's actually a good spot for him. We could do that, and then uh, do that. Okay, let's just. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. That's what things are looking like. Now this chaos transmutator actually might be pretty good. <laughs> I can just spam down like cheap towers and worst case scenario they get turned into a slightly more expensive tower. Or I guess they don't get transmutated at all and just stay the same, but Yeah, that's literally like the worst case scenario. This is ridiculous. Okay. 
We got so many towers, it doesn't even matter. This is just chaos. This chaos, I mean, I mean, yeah, literal chaos. It is called Chaos Transmutator. So yeah, now that I think about it, does the name make sense? Nice, stage clear. Got a new card as well, another L piece. Just what we needed. Between different targets. Oh, but it was only towers of the same size. Um so Yeah, I mean I think I, I think I like I like the muscle tower more. But, so yeah, we want, we don't, oh, but I should, I could have taken the scrap tower, so then I could have put down, uh, whatever. Without using flamethrower tower. Cost of drawing cards, can't really. Um. Uh, I guess I'll go with that, because... When it says do it without using the flamethrower tower, I have a feeling that when it transforms into the flamethrower tower, that it's probably going to be like, oh, no, no, you use the flamethrower tower, and I'm going to be like, well, the game made me do it. I... It's not like I can control whether or not I use the flamethrower tower. It literally forced me to do it. So. Okay, hold on. We need, we need a piece for like... I mean, to be honest, I think the dice towers would actually be better for this spot. Or I guess that works too. I am gonna kinda try to build up a spot for that though. And we could kinda block in this area a little bit, I think. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, it's fine right there. Wait, I just realized, can't I just farm money with this? Because if they turn into a tower that's more expensive, then I could sell that tower. That actually, that actually does exactly what I thought it. That that actually does work. I can just farm it.
Okay. So we already found a way to farm the farm money in this game. So that's great. <laughs> As long as we have a tower like the, the missile tower, which can kind of like carry us, then. See, and this guy got. Then, yeah, it doesn't really matter. I mean, that's good damage, but. I raise that and. I instead. Choose to build, to build another one of those guys. And then we can put that there. And then... Yeah, I mean, I'll, we just need to make sure that they're, like, it, always in the range of these, of the missile towers. Because these things are going to be what does the most damage. And then, the, then our other guys can kind of clean up a little bit. You're not face, dude, you're not facing the right, I think my flamethrower is broken. Okay, there we go, now he's fine. That was weird. You like he wasn't turning. Okay, now we can sell these guys and make our money back. <laughs> and for some reason, this guy ends up selling for more, which doesn't make any sense. Got multiple positions for them. I do like having the flamethrower right there, though. Oh my gosh. Yeah, these missile towers are absolutely demolishing everything. This is ridiculous. Swarm stuff is going to be a little bit hard, difficult for the missile towers to deal with, but like single target, they're going to evaporate. Even even with the swarm stuff, they still did pretty well. I wonder why some sell. Seems like the ones with like that are like um, get the six, like this one. Seems like they sell for more. Which is very odd. But whatever. Not not complaining. Yeah, I mean let, we just need a further push push them back and create more spots for towers to be placed. At this, at this point it just seems like it's a machine gun of missiles. They are 
starting to get kind of overwhelmed, which is not good. Oh, there goes a big guy. It's fine. Only one guy got past? Okay. I'll take it. Only one guy got past. It's fine. We didn't need that anyway, so we didn't need a, a long piece. Giant dice tower. Um, sure. I'll go for the... And now they can change into a... Which... That's fine. Okay. Yeah, if I could get him to go this way, so I could put like a piece here. And then have them go around and wrap back around this way. I think that would be. Uh, instead of that, I'll do that. And then I can put that guy. I think for now, I'm gonna leave this part open. But I do wanna put like a there eventually. It's like I want a piece there. To the main then. Alright. What are we gonna get? About oh, the six? Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I already have a feeling that this thing is going to absolutely destroy. He's going to get changed into a missile tower. Didn't it have a faster fire rate when it was a six, though? I'm confused. I'm assuming the nine on the top is the number it gets, that gets rolled. Unless I'm wrong. Yeah, let's sell these now. Now we can just have that guy there. And then we could have this guy here. That's a 14. Yep, okay. I do that? No. I'll just do that then. Mm, I don't even think that looks that good either.
think honestly that would probably be fine. And yeah, we'll just leave it at that. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll draw some of those guys. Okay, nice. I think we're I think we're in a good position right now. I think things are going well. Missile tower is gonna do pretty good. That guy's evaporating them as well. Is that, is that a fire rate of 15 even though there's a one on there? I'm confused. That is a one, right? Yeah, that's a one on the top. Okay. I mean, whatever, I guess. Wait, why can I put that there? Oh, it's because it, because that part's gonna wrap around. Ah, okay. Somehow I did not notice that it would do that. I think I'm stupid. Okay. Eventually, I want to put a piece there. Like a. Let's see, I want to. I could just do that. Okay, that works. Yeah, that's not that's not great. Wait, I can sell those. Uh, I guess I'll just put them down. Why not? Oh, there we go. I got my piece that I wanted. See, I still don't understand why that's a fifteen. And there's a one on the top. I'm not going to complain. I mean, I'll take the 15. I just feel like that there was some coding that got corrupted or messed up. Yeah, see, that's the one on the top, and now that one's at 16. I don't understand. Do that. And do that. And we can do that. Some more big guys down. And then put a bunch of little guys kind of spread out. Just in the cans that just in the cans? Just in the chance that bad things happen. up to a 12 and there's a one on the top see yeah things like that that's uh 
I could do that. Okay, that would work. See that. Actually, you know what? I need more spots for big guys. Let's make some room. Yeah, I mean, the little guys still, they still do decent. They still, they still have a roll. This guy is still at two, so I'm just going to sell him. Come on. Nice. That guy doesn't really have a use there. This piece doesn't really have a use anywhere either. Um. Blocking this part. I could block that. Or. Maybe blocking this part isn't such a bad idea. Because I'm making that they end up going this way. And that will. Increase the amount of time that they spend getting hit by that. I want a piece here that, like, the other L piece there. And then we could have this, like, go up that way. See, that's what I wanted. So, like, that there. I still understand why some of these are genuine like eights or uh, genuine genuine like low numbers and then other ones are like it'll be a one but it's it actually is 12 I don't understand
unless it's not actually 12 and it's genuinely a 1, but I have no idea. Nice! Things actually, and that would actually be good. That, yeah, that piece right there. That would be good. Okay, eliminate powerful enemies from a distance. Um, what's a 65? Honestly, for the sake of money, I'm kind of thinking about going for the sniper tower. But I think the boulder tower would be, would be better. Um, any electric towers? I don't really use electric towers ever. Poison effect also causes chill effect. I guess I could go with that. I don't have anything that gives poison either, but we'll just go for it. So yeah, let's go for the altar. Present offerings receive the receive the altar's blessing. Um, when the first fire source is attacked and its HP reaches zero, consume all your ember stones. After triggering this relic, will be destroyed. Ooh, card Honestly, maybe this piece here. I don't know. None of these are like that great. I'm just going to increase my health points. By the way. So didn't I have 14? Why did it go down to 12? Go to the shop. You kill a monster effect, but... Uh, go with Ice Storm, I guess. We don't have anything actually good, though. Go for the battle for this one. Get another square piece. Ooh, okay. This is gonna be an interesting one. No idea what that was. I think for now I am going to keep these the way they are. Nice. Got it just in time. Okay. Something like this. I have no idea. Then I could make it go like around like this way. So instead, it could be like that. Make me go like this way. Lock up this part. Yeah, 
yeah, something like this. Oh, but then I couldn't take advantage of that, so I would need that. And then... Do something with this, like that. Oh, okay, so I could have it... Okay, I have an idea. All setup kind of looks stupid, but it doesn't really work the way that I want it to. But it's fine. So they're going, look, they go around that way. extend that one out further I think. I think that would be good. Or can we is there any way we could get like okay. There we go. Get another one there. Probably something a little bit better. Yeah, 11, that's good. Okay. And that thing is just gonna meet, they're immediately gonna attack these things over here, which is amazing to me.
Like these, like these guys are just gonna kind of get picked off, and then, and then these guys will come in and won't have any like really backup because <laughs> these guys got absolutely destroyed. Yeah, that guy's done for. Okay. See, that's what I was after. And see, now he's up to 15. Somehow, some way, he's up to 15. Critical failure. So that now he's actually an official one. Okay. It actually will say like a, a failure thing. Okay, we'll do that and then we'll do. Oh, I don't know. I've never been the best when it comes to constructing mazes. go up that way, I guess. Yeah, we'll do that. Something like that. He's got actually pretty good range. This guy's gonna be annoying. This guy here. See, yeah, it seems like he makes them stronger. And it's not just one that he makes stronger, he makes any, he can affect multiple, make them stronger. Not sure how much stronger, but it still seems like they're getting destroyed. for 64 though. <laughs> That's a 20. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I thought that was a 21. I was like, oh, I don't think that's supposed to be like that. And I think there's really a point in me doing that, so I'm not going to. Is there any spot that would like get me another position to build a big guy? I guess over here I could do it. Let's see if I can get something better. Got a two. Definitely was not better. And confirm was not better. Oh, 
So now things are actually going quite well. Looks like we're gonna make it. Yeah, pretty easily as well. Wasn't too much of a struggle. Okay, nice. Got another one of those. Okay, nice. Snowball tower. Sure. I'm liking these big towers that I'm getting. Now we're on to this guy. Yeah, now our fire is back up to 14. I don't know what happened before. This is the boss level, okay. Build a turret on a minecart and it will automatically charge forward along the tracks once battle starts. Do various enhancement effects. Ooh, okay. If I can only. I can't put like a big tower on there, sadly. I think would be pretty cool. Wait, can I have them like crash? Like, can I have my towers like crash into them? I don't know if that would really work, but. I'll just do that, and then... Do that. Hey, 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 Leave my guys alone. Bro, what are you doing? Stop destroying my towers. They're chill. They're not doing anything to you. Okay. I guess maybe they are getting in the way of your devious plan, but come on. They're not that bad. made a good amount of money in the process, I would say. Okay. Oh, that tower is destroyed. Okay, that's not... Definitely not a good sign. I think we should be fine here, maybe. Okay. I wonder if the if the minecarts hitting them would do anything. That is definitely something that has me kind of intrigued. I'm just kind of using using them as like a way to fuel my I guess you could say addiction <laughs> of putting 
strong towers down. Giant Hydra guys. Real annoying. Get out of here. Get out of here. Wish it would transform them at like the start of the wing. Because, like, then it would transform, and then you could take advantage of the tower it transforms into, and then sell it on the next wave, but, you know, but that would be a little too overpowered, I, I understand. Now that we have that, hold on. Do that. sure what I want to do here. So I could do like that, that, and then uh, that, more like that. Now I could have that. Okay. I like that. Check out that's looking. See, and then there's a nine on there, but there's a six there. I don't. Or no, that is a six. I'm stupid. No, that's a five. Okay. I'm realizing now that earlier on in the video, when there was like a when I said there was a nine or something. It was probably a six. And I was like, why does it have a fire rate of six when it says nine? Probably just was a, probably just was a six. And I was just being stupid. I want them to, uh, I don't know how exactly I want to set this up. I mean, I guess I could have them go down and then go back up. Then I could just do that and have this part wrap around, wrap back around. Let's have this part like wrap back up. Uh, 
Um... Alright. I'll probably just leave these guys be for now. Let them do their thing. And just kind of focus on these guys. So much is happening anyways, I don't even think it's worth it that at this point to start selling, to sell, buy, sell, but I think it's just, I think we'll just stick with this. Things are crazy enough. Okay, let's speed things up. me a little bit concerned right now is how far enemies are getting. Um, so I'm not sure how worried I should be, but I'm currently quite worried. <laughs> Get another one. Oh, I can't send it back. I can do that though. I still have to go up. Okay. This guy is probably just going to get melted. Okay, he's getting a little bit further than I would like. Him. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold your horses. cheating a little bit. I'm kind of just extending the pathway as he's going. <laughs> he's like, he's like, I've already made it past the, the majority of the pathway and he just keeps extending it. I can't do anything. I'll just do that. Nice. He wasn't worried for a second. Wasn't worried at all. That actually went quite well. Um, um, I'm quite, quite happy with how that went. Um, so yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I hope you guys enjoyed the video of Ember Ward. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to like take a second, take a breather for what I just had to deal with. Um, but yeah, no, I, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Ember Ward. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. I mean, the world to me doesn't cost you guys anything. And uh, yeah, I'll definitely have to try and see if I can figure out if I can get the full version. I'm going to check Key Mailer real quick and see if Ember Ward is on here. Uh, it hasn't released yet, but it does say it's supposed to be coming out sometime this year with the full release. So... Hopefully, uh, I can get the key around that time. But yeah, without uh, further ado, I hope to see you guys in the next one. And yeah, you guys take care.